So as a follow-up to my last video on the water damage, um, the if you really wanted to solve the problem and just do the surgical, efficient, economical uh, method of just this this area here that used to be that old lean-to, just tear it down, rebuild the drywall, whatever you necessary, or tear the drywall out and, and leave the structure standing and just do the drywall, however you want to do it, or and then repaint this outside and remove that thing. If you want to do just that area here, which would be the, just a standalone structure on the interior, and leave those outside walls that are undamaged alone. If you did just that, then all you have to do is you just seal off. You could start a probably this uh, rafter here. You drop some plastic down there. Uh, or maybe you go to this other one out here. It doesn't matter. Then you can't, Then that gives you the outside door enclosed in the area as well. So maybe you go there. And that gives you this this area here. That, that, that this is this uh, um, sliding glass patio door. Um, so, so you could, so if you went, went from there, you would start up here and you would go, um, there's that rafter there, you come back here and that's, and that would, that goes to there. And then you would pick this one, or if you, you could take this one and then maybe jog over here or something. But, but you build, a, you just put a piece of plastic, uh, ceiling plastic, uh, uh, here, just across here, you know, where, where those curtains are, follow that curtain rod there. Go to that back wall, come back around here, go there, go to that door, you know, seal off the door, <clears throat> or whatever. Now you've got a working area, and there's plenty of room to work here, right, between the edge of that door there, uh, to the left side there that I'm showing, uh, all the way over to the, your work area that you're tearing down, is this area here, or working within, there. And then, <clears throat> so you know, <clears throat> so you just have one ceiling partition, it goes either side of the season fan, whichever rafter you want to use. Uh, do that. Um, then you could then all the storage area here you don't have to worry about, right? You seal it off or, or whatever. Um, uh, and I don't have to worry about that. And then back here, same thing. Um, you could go either this rafter here um, to start with hang the plastic from. That gives you, you know, that gives you all this work area. You know, that's how much work area you'd have there if you did that. Uh, this be in the area you're going to work in. Um, or you could go to this rafter here on the other side of the ceiling fan here, you know, and hang it there. But either way, all this stuff here then, back here, can just stay as it is. You have a sheet of plastic hanging here. Um, you've got, if you absolutely had to, you've got egress to this plotting glass area. Of course, that mattress would have to go. But um, <coughs> when I'm saying this, this is a very easy thing to do. Um, incredibly easy. Uh, like, you know, you're talking about a sheet of plastic, you know, steel top and bottom. That's it. Um, you know, I don't know why you'd want to make it any more difficult than that. Um, again, the carpet's separate matter. There's no issues of hazardous material with the carpet or whatever. Um, but, but certainly, you know, you do, you solve that problem both ways. But that's all you'd have to do is just seal off two side, two panels of plastic, hang down from one of these rafters, either here or this one here. Um, you know, hang a sheet of plastic down to the floor, tape it off, you know, seal it, and then you have all this, again, all this working area here that I, that I can clear out, uh, what I haven't cleared out already, you know, clear out that, all that area, uh, you know, um, and then this area here, which would be from, uh, biggest area, if you started from this rafter here, or if you went back here, you could use this rafter here. Even less, you know, which gives, still gives you plenty of working room. Plenty of working room. Um, basically, uh, it will give you this this area from to the left side. There's a rafter there uh, to there. This is the rafter then that winds up going alongside there. So, so you'd have I don't know. It's uh, uh, five feet on all the way around the central area you're working with, and then of course uh, up to the wall there. You wouldn't have to seal that. <clears throat> so anyway, this could be just very easy to do, plenty of working room, not incapacitating anybody any more than necessary, uh, very professional, very surgical, whatever. But I just wanted to add that to my comments here. Thank you.